project came about through discussions about ways that the university and the UTC could work more closely together in terms of making sure that our students are equipped with the skills to be able to apply for courses at Leeds University. So I'm going to go to the front of the car, and the front of the car gets the line. My role in the project was to basically design the project based around the curriculum for the year 10s at the UTC. The thing I found most challenging about the Discover Verbal Maths was the whole equations and the maths part. Some of the maths that we focused on was area, perimeter and volume of shapes. So they used those aspects to design the chassis of their buggy. And then we looked at the forces, forces on slopes, forces on flat surfaces. We looked at electric circuits and the maths behind that. With the help of Ola and Mr Hater, it really benefits us in our maths lessons. They come bouncing into my maths lessons now, you know, because it's the room that we've, we've been doing the stuff with Orla in and you know, it's where they're sort of, they feel comfortable, they've had a lot of fun, a lot of enjoyment, a lot of engagement doing activities in the room and they just see that as a really positive room now. The part I enjoyed the most was being able to see the students develop their ideas over the six weeks until they got to actually build the robotic buggy. One of my favourite moments of the project was when we got to race them because we all got to join in and have a go. The thing I liked most was the kick that you'd get in operating the buggy. Working in the team was quite fun actually. We had quite a lot of challenges that we had to face as a team but also a lot of independent work. When we visited the university, the students got a whole load out of it. It was really nice to meet the lecturers. I think that gave them a sense that what they were doing was very important and they felt very proud of their work. By meeting the other people and then seeing other students and seeing the department, they could sort of realise that actually what they're doing now is building up towards what's going to happen in the future and, you know, possibly that might be an avenue that they might go to.